Knights at Melbourne. The Christmas HCP over 1,200 metres. The court will be John Russell. Celera is standing in well. Lights on, they're off now. And it was a very good start too. And one of the first out, King Sarant. And his reward began speedily. And so also did Celera and Classy Rogers going very fast with Sonic Express. And just in behind them is Sereticus and Ricaria going quickly along the inside, followed by Marine Parker. Then McIntosh on the outside of Laronti, followed by Solomoth. And Keita has dropped out to last. They're coming up to the 800. And his reward by a length and a half. Celera to second, a half length back on the outside. Classy Rogue, followed by Ricaria. Proud value coming into the picture is next, followed by Marine Park looking for a run over on the insider. And a deeper on the track, just in behind them, moving up also there is Laurenti. And they were followed by McIntosh and Seraticus is back behind them, Solomoth and Keita. They're coming up to the home turn. And the leader, Andy's reward by length and a half, Ricari getting up along the inside, Celerida. Deeper on the track is King Saron, followed further back by Sonic Express, Classy Rug, Marine Park, nowhere to go. Andy's reward, the leader coming down to the 200, tackle quickly. Over on the outside now, finishing on a very strongly is Ricaria and over on the outside finishing on into the clear is Keita with a very strong run Keita on the outside is grabbing Ricaria Marine Parker's down the outside but Keita put his head in front close to home and Keita's got the money Keita's won the Christmas handicap a half length Ricaria third home in the event was Marine Park followed by Solomoth a good run from the rear then Seraticus and King Saronda and the next to finish is Laronti and his reward McIntosh never ran it well back in the field Celerita followed by Classy Rogue proud value and last home is Sonic Express. Runs from the, the race at Caulfield, race five, Christmas handicap. Winner was Keda. Paid 18 10 and 460 the place. Uh, then Ricaria 190 and Marine Park before from the David Hay stable 170. Jack Burke handicap over 1600 metres where the caller is John Tapp. They're off and running and title is a touch slow to move at the start. Nobody wants to lead. They've jumped out and they're cantering in the first hundred metres. So striking just in front of Southern Double. Vibrant Hayes pulling and reefing in third place followed by L.A. Yannick. Silencio between horses and then defensive play and title has last about five lengths off the lead. Now they've quickened a bit in the run to the first turn. Mick Dittman on Vibrant Hayes not at all happy with the pace. Allowed the grey to stride around the outside and take up the running. Vibrant Hayes clear going around that first corner by a length and a half to so striking ahead away southern double a length and a half silencio la yannick in trouble on the fence got squeezed right back out of it there and then title and defensive play as they swing around that first corner ditman stacks them up with vibrant hayes led about a neck on southern double silencio allowed to stride up three deep at the 800 mark a length and a half to so striking followed by defensive play and title and la yannick was knocked out of the race on the first turn and is back last of the seven as they come to the corner vibrant hayes with the inside running just led from Southern Double and Silencio making a line of three. Two away, so striking and defensive play, followed by Title and Ale Yannick, who's now hard ridden, but on the corner, Vibrant Hayes and Southern Double turn together, clear of Silencio, then defensive play, followed by so striking Ale Yannick and Title as they top the rise, coming to the 200 mark. And Silencio went to the lead over Southern Double, followed by defensive play, and then Ale Yannick, Silencio, the leader, defensive plays the danger. Defensive play coming after Silencio, Ale Yannick is running home hard but defensive play just in front Silencio kicking again but defensive play too good wins at a neck to Silencio in third place LA Yannick a very tidy effort followed by title and then southern double and so striking and vibrant Hayes not a leader has knocked up to finish last did you see back at the NCG the result of Ramwick race five Jack Burke handicap. Defensive play paid uh, $4.70 for the win, $2.50 the place. Silencio, $1.60. No third dividend for Ali Yannick. <laughs> 